All right, here we are at 1911 Old Colony Lane, Maitland, Florida, 32751. This is a four bed, two and a half bath, 2,970 square foot, listed at 899. 1985 home, has a lot of really good updates. It's in a very, very good part of Maitland. Uh, you can see this is here on a cul-de-sac. You've got nice um, mature landscaping everywhere. You see the neighborhood over here is doing their lawn. Just everybody really takes care of their house, which is nice. And right here is Thistle Lane here in the city of Maitland. When you turn right, that takes you right into the school going around. There's a stop sign over there. Uh, just a really good part of Maitland. A lot of established neighbors, good little spot. So we're walking up to the front door. The garage is a pull around on the back, which I'll show you. Here's a nice walk up. Here's the front entryway right when you pull in. You can kind of see right through those windows, you see the school. So walking to school is an absolute possibility. Plantation shutters, knocked down with the crown molding. Here in the sitting room, TV, living room. Really good natural light. And we'll pop down here first. Absolutely love these hardwood floors. Here's the half bath. And then here into your master. You've also got these two French doors, so that I can close that off, allowing your guests to use that restroom, but also keep it separate from the bedroom. Nice large walk-in closet. And here into your master bath. Plenty of storage in here as well. You've got obviously storage here. And then even in here, you've got additional linen space. So this home was built in 1985. Back through the master. And nice vaulted ceilings all the way up. Beautiful built-ins. Again, natural light abundant here throughout the home. Well, I'll get back to this corner over here. That door right there is out through the bathroom, obviously. It could be used if there was a pool back here for a pool bath, but obviously no pool here on this house, as you can see that backyard. Plenty of play space for the kiddos. You see straight through from the front door here, the living room into the dining. Here is your dining space, which leads into the kitchen. Again, those wood floors continue in here that we saw in the other part of the house. You get more storage coming this way as we head towards the garage. You've got the built-ins in there, straight through into the laundry room. Nice little wash bin in here. Head down this hallway. And again, if to orient you straight ahead from here is the pull-in where we walked in. The corner is to our right. Nice large bathroom area and space.
So bedroom number two. Bedroom number three. Again, these closets are all pretty similar. I'll show you this one. It does have these built-ins. And bedroom number four. And here is your two car garage. And that is the back side where you come in right here. And I'll show you that when we go over there. You do have a garage going out to the little patio that's over there. Looks to be Pax Plumbing. There's two electrical pipes, excuse me, electrical boxes. Looks like it's got the whole home HVAC. I mean, excuse me, whole home vacuum. <laughs> it's a carrier unit, 2021. 13. 13 on this one? 14. 14, there we go. 2014. All right, let's go see the outside. No, I'm just taking a video. Uh, I'm just taking a video. <laughs> it is nice and cold in here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> here is your covered patio. It's got this cedar top up here, which looks really nice. Obviously, it'll last a long time here, so you don't have to worry about that. Take you out to the back patio, and I'll show you where the driveway looks out back to the school. So you can see right there where that person's pulling up. That is the stop sign here on the corner. Domerick Elementary. I'm going to walk over this way. So here's the back side. Extra parking pad. So you'd obviously come down this way and pull in your driveway. There's Domerick Elementary. Maitland Middle is right on the other side. So just to kind of show you. And you got a lot of this natural, mature trees that are growing here not to make it look that this is going to be a busy spot not a lot of not a lot of crazy traffic comes through here obviously during your school times it's a little bit heavier but other than that as you can see today it's pretty quiet we've got two cars coming through when the school is open you can use that gate to get into the school as well and here's your backyard obviously they have the kind of split up a little bit there's probably some furniture out here at one point but you've got a pretty wide open area to kind of do what you want back here set up a play swing set up really anything you can almost reimagine this whole space back here but these walls obviously help with any kind of noise or anything that you're going to have when schools and session things like that but you can see there's a brand new build right next door and there's a couple here on the street